Good morning, everybody. Day 56. Just left that communication tower. Must be for like better communication than what I have. <laughs> but I was able to go like over the hill a little bit this morning and get my video out. So that's always good. <laughs> But I was like on the other side of the, where the tower was, so kind of crazy. But anyway, we're going to be running into Harper's Ferry today. Always kind of nice running in there. Used to be super nice running in there, but now it's just like, eh, whatever. It's cool historical, though. I mean, historically, that town is amazing. It looks like we're getting ready to climb the last little bump of the roller coaster. I probably should have just went through it all yesterday, but oh, I had no reason to push. So yeah, and look, I'm rambling, but we're going to Harper's Ferry today, everybody. And I hope you guys have a great, great day. And I'll touch back with the cool stuff and the views just like I do, baby. So. Let's go enjoy the day and get to Harper's Ferry. Check out the old downtown. It's pretty cool. Oh, I gotta go to the Outfitter too. I've got a package there. <laughs> Spring. So I had a little bit of a rookie moment. I knew all night and all morning that I had to stop here and get water because it's eight point something miles to the next water. And that water is downhill too. And I blew right past this, like a half mile. And I'm like, oh no, did I already pass that water? So I looked on gut hooks, sure enough, half mile passed. So <laughs> I walked back a half mile to get water because I had maybe one drink of water left. So, <laughs> rookie mistake. That's hilarious. I was just walking, boom, and I'm like, oh, past my water source. <laughs> Whatever. It happens. Beautiful. Look where we're at. You're about to enter the roller coaster. So, oh, look. The roller coaster is done. Look at these. Look at these random. These things are in the weirdest places. But they're so cool. This ridge walk's pretty cool. It's grassy with big boulders everywhere. Big as your car, I'm bigger. That size boulders. It's pretty sweet.
I haven't seen a single person today either, which is crazy. <laughs> you can see the trail forever. Forever and ever. That's where it came from. That's where we're going. Birds are arguing this morning. So that's what it sounds like. Maybe they just want me out of here. I hear a woodpecker too. There he is. All right, everybody. We're at a view spot. I took another side trail. Zoom me in. Buzzard Rock Views. <laughs> so yesterday we were on Buzzard Hill. Today is Buzzard Rock. So, yeah. Nice little rock garden with this cool little view of this valley. And this little, little, tiny, tiny little mountain range. Oh, I'm way off on my finger. Where is it? Right here. This little one. It's tiny. Yeah, side trail back to Buzzard Rocks. I actually remember it being a little better of a view than that. Unless I'm just thinking of somewhere else. Who really knows? <laughs> but it said Buzzard Rock View. I had to come back here. It wasn't that long with side trail. Maybe point two. Maybe. Threw a bunch of rocks. <laughs> but I love rocks. All right, let's get back to the AT make our way into Hoppers Ferry. What's happening everybody? So I just passed the David Lesser Memorial Shelter. That is the last place to get water pretty much till you get into Harper's Ferry. But the problem with that water is it's point two down to the shelter and point one down to the water from the shelter. So a total of point three. And I was just looking at gut hooks and I noticed on oh, three more miles, instead of going point three down to the water at David Lesser Memorial Shelter, I can just go three more miles to Keys Gap. I think it's Keys Gap. Where I can go point three right down the road to a gas station. And I can get anything I want to drink. Not water, that's for sure. I'm not gonna be getting water at the gas station. But it's the same distance for fluids. So I'm choosing anything but water. <laughs> and I heard they have a grill a grill at this gas station. I've never been to this gas station, but I don't know why I haven't. Probably because I don't know why I haven't been there. Probably because I'm just like, oh, let's get to Harper's Ferry. Forget it. But I'm just like, eh. <laughs> Point three off trail. A gas station with a grill 
and probably whatever I want to drink with flavor, something with flavor. So yeah, I'm going down here to Keys Gap where I will be walking point three. I'll make a right when I get to this road, walk point three down to this convenience store gas station where I'm gonna get some goodies. <laughs> I'm so close to Harper's Ferry, I don't know why I'm just not gonna push in there, but you know, I kinda needed water anyways, or some kind of fluids, and instead of going down a side trail past the shelter, I might as well just go get something I really, really want. Point three is point three. Barbecue pulled pork with coleslaw on it. Potato wedges, Mountain Dew, ketchup and hot sauce, two baby bells, carrot cake for dessert, and a monster energy drink. The mean bean to go. <laughs> yeah, you're not getting this at a shelter. That's for sure. You might've been able to get water, but this point three little road walk was so worth it. It was pretty much flat the whole way here. And look, I got a delicious lunch. And when I leave here, I'm like five or six miles away from Harper's Ferry. So this is a perfect little stop. I can't believe I've never stopped here before going northbound. Crazy. But now I'm gonna look really homeless and eat all this stuff sitting right here. All right, what a great little stop. Barbecued pulled pork with coleslaw on it. Mmm, it was delicious. I think I'm five or six miles away from um, the bridge, the train footbridge where you walk over. So all the way through Harper's Ferry, almost to well, I'm going to go all the way to the footbridge. <laughs> there, that's pretty simple. You know, the footbridge that the train goes across, and then you walk across that too, right after Harper's Ferry. Yeah, so, I'm just going to keep going north until I get to that famous footbridge that was taken out last year. And uh, that's where I'm going to call it a day. I'm pretty sure I've got everything figured out as far as transportation and where I'm staying and yeah pretty sure I got it all figured out we just got to get there which shouldn't be too big of a problem especially because I got a full belly off gas station food hmm What's happening, everybody? So the last few miles, the trail's been really rocky. I mean, the rocks don't bother me, but some people are gonna bother. They're everywhere. Guess I didn't remember this ridge being covered in this many rocks. It does slow you down just a little bit, but not much. And I'm in no hurry anyways. I got nowhere to be at any certain exact time. So I'm good to go. Oh, it's getting super warm out too. I'm just dripping sweat and my, my beard's dripping. Yeah, it's warm. It's supposed to be 80s or something coming up next week. The 80s. <laughs> I 
Okay, so this is the last time we'll be in Virginia. We are bouncing the border there for a little while. But this is like the official spot. <laughs> so maybe yesterday was a little premature, but whatever. We're in West Virginia now for, for good. We're done with Virginia for good. So, yeah. But it seems to me like I always, always count that other one. I guess that would be for the south bounders. And this one's for the north bounders. Tomato, tomato, potato, potato. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. But yeah, check Virginia off the list for good. <laughs> it's funny. I totally forgot about that little part. Cause that's pretty much where you would start the four state challenge. Look at this. Booyah, baby. And I hope he found what he was looking for. Because he sure did work hard at it. Look at all them holes. <laughs> White blaze, baby. Alrighty, guys. So we are dropping down to... The Shenandoah River. I'm gonna walk right across down a bridge. It's a pretty sweet bridge too, actually. There's traffic winging by though. <laughs> when you're right beside the road. But it's safe. I mean you're on a little walkway. Ooh. <laughs> little ankle roll there. I don't know why with this flat ground. <laughs> Boop! That's where it came from. See this bridge? We're gonna walk right up here on this side of it. Shenandoah River's right here. Look. Let me show you just how busy of a road we're going to be on. It's busy, but it's got its own little sidewalk. Boom. Quiet blaze. Road noise. Yeah, this is awesome. Super duper cool. The Shenandoah River, everybody. It's beautiful. Hey, let me zoom you in. Look at the rocks. I guess you can't really tell from here. Trust me, it's cool. <laughs> Harper's Ferry, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah. Loving it. 
Zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this semi to honk his horn. Oh yeah! <laughs> Here's another one. Let's see if we can get two out of two. I doubt it. He's got traffic all around him. Nope. Jefferson Rock, everybody. Jefferson Rock. Oh, I've never got up here before. <laughs> Probably not supposed to be up here. It's all supported up. How cool would it be to have your own rock? Well done, Jefferson. <laughs> your rock has a beautiful view too, my friend. Until they built that church there. But actually the church looks pretty cool there. I'm gonna zoom you in. Yeah. Jefferson Rock, everybody. I can picture Jefferson standing up here. Like, no, you can't come up. This is my rock. <laughs> it's hilarious. And people have carved their names all over this rock. crazy leave no trace people backpack about pushed me off the rock and after talking smack I bet Jefferson's ghost wouldn't have saved me <laughs> he probably would have laughed at me <laughs> Jefferson rock everybody So right after you leave Jefferson Rock, like immediately, <laughs> you come to this. Look at this. I think it's an old church. How cool. That's probably the new one. <laughs> Saint, yep, St. John's Episcopal Church. And pause it if you want to read it. But there she is. And this is where we start walking pretty much in town, Harper's Ferry. Man, that is a nice church right there. Holy cow. <laughs> they need those signs about every 10 feet on the Appalachian Drill. <laughs> I love how this, this is just all stone, everybody. How you doing, guys? Good, how are you? Doing great. It's beautiful. Good. You an AT hiker? I am. <laughs> What's happening, everybody? End of the day recap. 
Day 56, we left that campsite by that tower at 1,009 miles. And we're now sitting at Harper's Ferry, pretty much the corner there by High Street, right before you go under a little bridge and then over the footbridge, right at the corner there. And that is 1026, makes it a 17 mile day, everybody. And when I got in town, I knew I had a package at the outfitter for me. So I pre-opened some of this stuff because <laughs> it was packaged very, very well. And I think I might have left something in Scott and Kathy's truck, but we will see. Check this out, everybody. Boom, Rocky Mountain Barber Company. <laughs> but this is what's super cool about this. <laughs> Look at this beard brush, everybody. Yeah. Pretty awesome. My own customized, my own customized beard brush. How cool. That's awesome. Oh, and it smells good too. Mmm, it smells really good. And then there was some SWD, there's some side straps for my backpack, I guess. I don't really know how they work. I have to do some research on that and I really don't know if I'm gonna use them, but they are pretty cool. And I will see what they're all about. And look, some stickers, the CBs. CBs can do. Look, all different kinds of sizes of stickers. So, yeah, this is awesome. Super duper cool, look. <laughs> yeah, how sweet. Bill Compton, thank you so much. I love this. And I'll put a couple of these stickers to use on something I'm carrying right now. And the rest, well, when I got down at the corner there, Harper's Ferry, Mr. Scott Fails, the Fails, I'm in their area, so. Scott was there, grabbed me up, uh, and he's still got some of my, uh, he's got my old Hawk hat, he's got my gloves, uh, I'm gonna give him some of these stickers, uh, maybe these straps, and then maybe that metal tag too, I'm gonna give him all that stuff and have him mail it back to the P.O. Box in Georgia for me. Uh, so, oh, and Scott and I were, he, Scott picked me up and we were gonna go into Charlestown, where I'm at right now, at the Motel 6. Uh, and we we're gonna go grab something to eat. We drove by the Appalachian Trail Conservancy, and there was four other hikers there that I've kind of been bouncing around with. So there's Hero, Bam, Tenacious, and Pippin. They were all at the ATC. So we pulled up, Scott asked them if they wanna go grab something to eat. We all went to Charlestown, got some grub, and then Scott dropped everybody off pretty much where they needed to go. Some people were picked up there. Um, yeah, what a great time. Nice little dinner with some other hikers and Mr. Scott Fails. And that's pretty much a wrap on the day. Tomorrow I'm gonna zero. I'm undecided. I'll probably go live. I'll probably go live. But tomorrow for dinner, I'm going out with Scott and Kathy. So that's kind of why I'm kind of questioning about going live. But no worries, I'll put something together so you guys got something to watch, either alive tomorrow night or you'll have a video the next morning. So that's what it is, everybody. Day 56, huge shout out to Bill Compton for sending me this goodie bag to the outfitter and Mr. Scott Fails, as always. This is his area, Scott and Kathy. <laughs> I love it, baby. Day 56. 17 miles, and I hope you guys had a great, great day. And I'll touch back with you guys tomorrow, baby.